fishing. Guys, this is a I-90 right here, literally downstream from one of the most, the you know, transcontinental freeways in the U.S. It runs from Washington State all the way to New York, I believe. Thank you to Rich at Evening Hatch for telling me about this hole. I just caught the second trout in the last 20 minutes. Wow, just bitter cold. It's 16 when we started it maybe it's 25 now i don't know but uh this is really a fun afternoon time to get that guy on his first fish of the day thanks for tuning in Not huge, but it's decent. Wow, Jay, we got one in, man. That's nuts. Wow, that's a nice bow. I'll take it all the oh. Hey, <laughs> there he goes in the net. Heck yeah, man. My first Yakima fish. This is so exciting. He's not huge, but he's nice. I mean, he's 15 or 14 for sure. Wow, that is so cool. That makes me so happy. Thank you so much for netting that guy for me, bud. That's it. You mind doing it? Mm -hmm. All right, buddy, so we're gonna place this over here. I'm gonna stand on it. Okay. And do you want me to release it? Yeah, that's totally I mean, it's cool. your fish. That's totally cool. It doesn't matter at all. I'm gonna do a release from from right here on the side. Actually, let's go. When you set him down, I'm gonna follow the fish with you so it goes down at the same all time. Right. All right. All right. Here we go, buddy. <laughs> hey, Jay. The, the yeah. Board, buddy. We did it. Oh, what a recording. <laughs> it's okay. This one got it. one day it's a really nice one wow this 
Dude, you're killing him. Just a bonus fish, man. This That's another big, big one, though. Bigger than the other one. Maybe not by Ooh. that. Man, he came out of the water three times. Just a gem of a fish. Yeah. Here he comes. Look at that one. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> About the same size. Nice. Yeah, maybe it's the same fish. <laughs> <laughs> it's got to be about 2.30, 3 o'clock, second one, in about 15 minutes on the Sculpzilla. Such a pretty fish. They're so strong. He came out of the water about three times. We're going to get him back home. Nice. Another one. Yeah. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there it is. That's a nice size. That one's I think it's bigger as... than the first two. Oh, really? You think so? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Oh, wow. It is, it is. It's a tiny. Yeah. Good, oh, man. <laughs> look at that fish, Whoa. This is worth a photo. This is worth a photo. It's all wrapped up. You might get that. Oh, yeah. All day, three pounds. That thing is a tank. Let's get a release on this fish. So Jay and I are going to change locations here. He's uh, he's probably about as cold as I. How you doing, dude? Dude, how are your hands and feet? Caught five of them. None of them were on camera. So just please believe me. <laughs> please believe me. <laughs> uh, steelhead was about this right. Size. Yeah, right. Oh, <laughs> well, we definitely caught some frozen hands and feet today, and that's for sure. So Jay, you want to move spots here, boss? Let's do that. All right, we're heading back towards. The car, we're gonna cross the river and try one hole to, to get Jay a fish here before the end of the day. You can see my breath, it's getting colder by the minute. Really a challenge to just keep our appendages, fingers and toes from freezing and falling off right now. Such an amazing adventure. It's a really good time to close things up. Jay's gonna fish for a little bit longer. I broke off my fly and I'm way too cold to retie. I'm grateful. Not only did I catch my first fish in the Yakima River, but I caught four. So meaningful. This is a, a classic Washington stream and I've always struggled here. So to catch four nice fish on a freezing cold January day, is incredible constellation. We're gonna close out the day, head back to the car and try to thaw out our fingers. And if I didn't have these hand warmers, there's no way I could be holding this phone. Yeah, after the 20th fish, the we're done. <laughs> <laughs> Jay's got a good sense of humor. Well, just like what we talked about, even if the water is cool, it almost looks like there's no way there will be fish. Never lose hope. Keep casting with the right technique. <laughs> uh, you'll always catch fish. Something I learned today. And hey, got to give it to this guy. Keeping a good attitude and being optimistic. There's many days where I've gone where I'm the guy that's not catching anything and it's tough to go back and start fresh and wipe the slate clean every cast. His underwater release videos are unlike any, especially the slow-mo. He's got it <laughs> dialed in. So I owe this guy for getting some amazing release videos of my fish today. So on that note. Well, 
Adventure, Adventure on! on. <laughs>